The fifth pulls. Pulls it up top. He tries to scramble for the rebound as well. Dribbles back into the lane. Splits two guys. Oh, I thought he had a layup. Yeah. If they want to play the offense that way, that's fine with me. Nice Go, pass. Pass. Go for those low percentage shots, please. Yeah, that was a nice shot. Nice pass. Nice shot. So right away, Toledo goes up 2 nothing. Slowing the pace down here. Latin posts up. Nice right-hand dribble. Latin Davis up for Rookie of the Year honors this year. And I believe James Johnson is up for Sixth Man of the Year. Is he really? He is. He wasn't even, you know, a big factor early on in the season. It just tells you about his development in the yes. developmental league. Yes, his three-point shot became absolutely lethal, and he can guard down low for big guys on opposing squads. So. What a play by Big Sam. Using that footwork, man, he really has worked on his low post work this whole season. He was almost entirely a perimeter guy uh, doing uh, screens up top the whole season, and now he's like, yeah, I can I can handle my myself down low. The rebound comes down. Mo Jones with the ball. Jones with pull-up jumper, no good. Mo Jones coming off of a rest week, weekend last weekend, so we'll yep. see how long it takes him to get his get his feet back underneath him. Him and James Johnson. They're right, and James Johnson. Long cross-court pass, three-point shot on the way, and good for Vaughn. Ball brought right back down to Myron Jackson. I didn't even see the pass. I just saw Mo Jones going right at the rim. And then the ball was gone. I was like, oh, look at Houdini. Oh, they, they running. They're running. <laughs> yeah, I like the defensive intensity. Oh, my God. As we get the first stoppage of the game. It looks like that's going to be Jackson's first foul. I think that's who they called it on. Eight twenty-one left. Six-five Lansing over visiting Toledo Glass City. Oh, Pump fake. I thought he was gonna pull it. I thought he was too. That was back to Barrington. Dribble drives through, kicks it back out to Vaughn. Vaughn misses on this one. That was a smart play. Muldrow would have swatted that into the next dimension. Jamir Jackson into the lane. Oh, oh couldn't get it to fall. Ball's taken back down court. Shots on the way, no good. Rebound comes down to Brown. Brown is able to put it back in. Nice play by Brown. As the DJ picks it up. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. Motor up top, give and go with Latin Davis. No good. Ball comes out to Jones. Jones throws the ball off of a defender right into my hand. <laughs> Fantastic. And the heads up play by uh, Mo Jones. They are smushing him over there in the corner. He's like, ah, now nah, we'll just take, do this the easy way. Jones gets ready to trigger it in from the side. Triggers it in to Davis. Davis takes a three-point shot. Booyah! Ooh! Yeah, that quick stab. <laughs> Got him just enough space he needed. That jab step. To make that open three. Darrington's up top. Oh, big fella's in. DeAndre. Oh, how'd I miss that? Oh, nice pump fake along the baseline and good runner off the glass. That's old school fundamental basketball there. Yeah, I, thought, I saw DeAndre Thomas. I was like, whoa, whoa, where'd he go? Ah, Bro. Jones can't get that to fall. Shot's no good. DeAndre Thomas in the lane, and they're going to call DeAndre for the foul. That looked like a straight pack to me, but uh, I thought so. He just stood there and he put his hand out, and the guy jumped into his hand. It's like I don't know. So the break of the action, we are going to step away, and we're going to get a quick word from our sponsor, TBL Basketball, live from the Pyramid, Don Johnson Fieldhouse, Lansing, Michigan. Tie ball game, nine nine, twenty twenty two, TBL playoffs. Fired by the underdog. Any blue. There are other techniques. Probably. 
He's like, I didn't move, bruh. They're watching your feet. They're watching them, yeah. <laughs> yeah, they rarely call a travel call. So if they call the travel call, it's because they saw a travel. Yeah, Davis picks him up, full court. DeAndre comes, helps out. Big fella with the defense at, at the perimeter. Oh, nice goodness. hedge. Ball kicked down. Good help by Sam. Sam up for defense player of the year. Gets one block, but great job by Vaughn staying with it. He was at one point SEC Defensive Player of the Year. I think you told me that about Sam Muldrow. Yes, so he was. Him getting it here would be fitting. DeAndre just walks it down. You can't do anything about that. He, just, he literally just bounced it back up, and dude was like, he just bounced it off his booty. Brother, you too small to guard me. <laughs> and another foul on the hedge by Thomas. We're gonna, hey, I, I say you just. Just start jabbing him. Don't don't give full hedge. Because the way I just saw him score easily, fourth quarter, it's going to be very hard for those guys to stick with him. It's everything. It's everything. High percentage shots late in the game to make sure you get points on the board is everything in the playoffs. Shot taken. No good. Rebound to DeAndre. Ball brought back down by Mo, real quick. Latin Davis with the ball. Lant kicks back out to Momo with a three-point shot on the way. No good. Rebound comes down to Brown. 13-11 to lead the Glass City over Lansing. Sam with the hedge that time. Ball kicked over right into the paint. Saw Big Sam there. Decided he's not going to take that shot on the way. Oh. No good. And they're going to call for a foul. I'll give it to Darrington. He did a great acting job on that one. <laughs> Latin Davis is just kind of like, what happened? It's like, yeah, well, I mean, he he moved right when your hand was up there and the ref was there and bam, three points. Or an opportunity for three points. That's it. First one's on the way and good. You know what Rasheed says. Uh, I know. I, I don't want it to be right. I was so happy. <laughs> <laughs> Believing what I wanted. 14-11 Toledo. Second one done way. As Brundage is going to come in for Davis. Get one more. DeAndre. Imagine that, DeAndre talking. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love it. Last one is true. Man, five for five for Christopher Darrington so far at the foul line. That's it. Lansing has, well, Glass City has committed zero fouls on Lansing. DeAndre walks Ooh. in. That's what I'm talking about. I'm telling you. We can't let this guy get in foul trouble. Or work. You know what I mean? Yes. Three-point shots on the way. No good. Brundage with the knockaway. Oh, nice box out by Brundage. Oh, my goodness. Shot by Jackson. How is that not a foul? I can't ask questions. I don't want to know the answers to. Ball oh. taken down. And Sam with the block. And the ball is off of Byron. I don't know what Jamiron thought was going to happen there. <laughs> he touched the ball and it's going out of bounds. Man, they were just bouncing off DeAndre Thomas at that baseline. That was hilarious. He bounced like three of them. They all went out of bounds. Paul's <laughs> thrown into Owens. Owens. Guarded by Brundage, step back three, no good, rebound to Sam. Ball is brought back down by Moe. Moe kicks it outside to Carlton. Oh, nice play. They lost him. Oh, oh. no. Flush that big fella. Moe with a double pump, no good. That's a huge missed opportunity for Lansing. Agreed. I mean, Moe was going for the foul, which, okay, good. 
But wow. Nice rebound. I can't believe Suttles missed that. Man. I can't believe Suttles didn't throw it down. You know, that's a good point. And Mo walks. I think this is more travel calls in a game than I've seen probably all season. I mean, that's three so far, isn't it? I haven't seen this many, I'll be honest with you. I'm trying to think back, and I can't remember. Exactly. 349 left. Darrington guarded by Jones. Gets inside the three-point line, no good. Rebound by Vaughn. Vaughn kicks it back outside. To Darrington, Darrington. To Pratt, excuse me. And we're going to get a foul. Who are they going to call that on? They're going to call that They're on Brundage. They're going to call it on Lansing, yeah. Brundage was boxing out, but he was waving his arm and caught the... He caught Katoine. Sent him to the line for two. Yep. Put Singleton at the line. Katoine's first shots of the game. First one's good. As we get substitution in, Sykes comes in for the game. Settles and Sykes. Settles and Sykes, buddy cop. Buddy cop, they're in now. <laughs> See if we can't make a little bit of a run here. Second one's on the way, good. I wouldn't mind a couple of soaring dunks in that run. Those two guys, man, they got bounce. Jones up top. A little shake and bake, and he's going to be fouled. They're going to call him shooting. Yep, they're going to save the shooting. Good. I think that's the first foul against Lansing by Glass City for the quarter. Man. Who'd they call that on? Do you know? No. It's no good on the first. Three sixteen left. Second one is good by Jones. Lansing down for Devontae Pratt brings the ball up court. It's the ball up top. Darrington. Darrington met there by Jones. Three-point shot. It's good. Oh. That was the tightest defense Darrington had on him. And Latin Davis was the first guy on him. And he makes his first three-pointer of the night. Shot no good. Rebound down to Darrington. He's met there by Jones. Spins away. Kicks the ball outside. Swung one more. Shot from the corner. No good. Rebound to Sykes. Ball kick to Brundage. Brundage three on the way. In and out. No good. Ball four. That ball's got to stay with Lansing. It's got to stay here. That's off Glass City. That's got to stay here. It's got to be off of Glass City. That's a bad call. Looks like we're going to get a break. So, with this timeout breaking the action, we're going to break from the pyramid. 21 14, Toledo over Lansing. We will be right back. TBL playoff basketball. Fieldhouse, which is the home of Lansing Eastern High School. But uh, come game day for the Pharaohs, it's going to be called the pyramid. Lansing loves basketball and has some great players that are from this city. And what I'm hearing, everybody's excited to get a chance to come out and check us out. Well, I think having the Lansing Pharaohs in Lansing, Michigan, will bring the community together with sponsorships from companies like Delta Dental. It helps build and strengthen our community. Uh, we're just looking forward to uh, starting the season here in March, and we hope everybody comes out and supports in the area. Welcome back, Don Johnson. Fieldhouse as the Atomic Dog plays in the background. 21-14 Toledo over Lansing. Let's see if Lansing... Yeah, we don't know whose possession it is so far. Yeah, I think they called it off Lansing and given it to Toledo. Yeah, Lansing is staying at that side of the court, so it looks like it is Glass City ball.
Got a nice little crowd out here to see the professional basketball. A beautiful. God, is it nice. Oh. Oh. You love when the sun is shining, but it doesn't feel hot outside? Yes. And the doors open behind us. Makes it even better. Oh. It's Darrington with the ball. Into the paint, left hand, finish. Christopher Darrington already has to be over 10 points. He's going to be a problem if they don't shut him down. Excuse me. He will continue to be a problem if they don't shut him down. Psych shot, no good. Ball goes out of bounds. Thomas is coming back in from Muldrow. Yep. And looks like Little's getting his first time. First action of the night. Oh, Montreal. Hell yeah. 153 left. Oh, I thought I saw some shifting of the both feet for uh, Mr. Darrington. It ain't no doubt who they want scoring the basketball today. No. <laughs> well, he's the only one who can actually put it through the hoop today. Everybody else needs to be bricking kind of hard. If we can shut down Darrington and allow the rest of the team to do what they're currently doing, Lansing's going to have the easy road to play in the playoffs. First That's round. Good pass down the little. Shot on Oof. the way. Nice shot by Sykes. See if that doesn't get him going a little bit. Man, drove to the baseline, lifted up, nobody around, put it down. Darrington met. Oh. Backdoor cut, nice play. Oh my God, number 12, Jonathan Brown saw that coming and get it right to number three, Devontae Pratt. For two, that was Devontae Pratt, right? It was, yeah. absolutely. Okay. Ball's back down here. Latin Davis gets it in, kicks it out. Ball's kicked down low, the big fella. Little with the ball, Montreal, how's that not a foul? <laughs> well, at least they didn't call him for that amount. Looks like Jamiron's coming back in. Going to get Brundage. Forty-nine seconds left. Ball into Latin Davis. Davis looking for Jackson. Coming well, he back better shoot. Up. And shot clock violation. Yep. Oof. Forty-three seconds left. Ball take it down court. Blocked by Sykes. Oh, and they ruled it off Glass City. Specifically, Devontae Pratt. Turnabout's fair play, I guess. <laughs> nice play by Sykes. Ball's brought down by Davis. Davis three. No good. Can't get the rebound. Glass City gets the ball. Ball taken down by Pratt. Pratt to Owens. Owens met there by Little. Rocker step, rocker step, rocker step. Ball kicked across. Jemiron hedged by Little. Oh, way oh, to wow. split it. That was a nice job. But the ball didn't touch the, the rim when the clock they, ran down. You can't count that. Well, they stopped playing because the shot clock went off and they thought it was the horn. And so I'm thinking that basket's going to count. I thought if the ball hadn't touched the rim, even if it's in the air. Now, I guess if it's in the air. It's in the air. Yeah, but if it hits the rim, it's just got to be out of his hand. Got to be out of his hand. So if the shot clock so he's ends. So he's going to say it right here. We're going to stay here and find out what they're going to say. As the referee's at the table. And it's going to be 27. Yep. Goodness. I've learned something on how the rules work. I thought if the ball hit the rim, like that was a, that was a, a shot clock violation. No, you just got to have it out of your hand. Okay. So as we sit here, I want to give some shout outs. Moneyball Sportswear, BRD Printing, Orthopedic Rehab Specialist, F45 Training, Wilson Protective Services, Chick-fil-A, Stacks 92.1 FM, Nuthouse, across the street from Jackson Field, home of the Lansing Lugnuts, Walkworthy Menswear, Sticky, official uniform provider, 
of the Lansing Pharaohs and Myotech for donating for every three point shot made donations go into Ellie's place so we'll get a rundown here of the first half score yeah man 10 points for Christopher Darrington to start off the game that is a bad sign you can't let this guy be on pace for 40 points in your first game of the playoffs against a team you know you can beat, who you have beaten before, you've held close when you lost to before. So, yeah, Lansing has a little bit of cleanup to do on the defensive end. The shots are going to go down because Lansing can shoot the lights out, but they're going to have to really hunker down on defense because when the shots ain't going, you can always get some offense going with, some, with a really hard, hard defensive play. Pratt inside, and they're going to say the ball was knocked away by Thomas. DeAndre Thomas has some of the fastest hands on this court. Like nobody can nobody can interrupt a possession. Well, him and Mo Jones, they can interrupt a possession just by standing there and moving their hands around. Yeah. Shot, I thought he walked. I thought so as well. Shot's good. But I guess when you catch the ball, you're going to shoot, you get a couple of, you get a couple of steps, so I guess he took him that way. He definitely took him. <laughs> 30 to 16, they've almost doubled up the Pharaohs. Pharaohs better find find the basket soon. Ball kicked out to Davis. Davis penetrates in, gets it to Jackson. Jackson's three on the way, no good. Ball knocked around, still fought for, and we're gonna get a shot clock violation because the ball didn't hit the rim. But it was in Glass City's possession and Mo Jones was trying to steal it back. I guess they didn't count that as possession since he didn't have two hands locked right. on the ball. I guess since he was bouncing on the ground. DeAndre Thomas with that rough perimeter defense. Fall away is good by Owens. Owens got the first five points for this. This half. Backing him down, big fella. DeAndre with fall away, no good. Rebound to Glass City. We've come up, they've doubled us up now. Oh wow, Katuan wide open. Didn't pull. And oh. that's the third one on the big fella. Yeah, he signaled to come out. It's not a choice, bro. You gotta come out. <laughs> yeah. Ten thirty left. Tuan's first one on the way, no good. That's the first good thing that's happened to Lancey in this quarter. Second one, marking it up. Ball's on the way. Good. It's one or two. Lansing down 17, and none of the starters have really gotten off with some significant offense. Davis with the left hand, can't get it to fall. Muldrow can't come down with the rebound. Ball is taken right back down by Singleton. Right hand, left hand, finish, no good. Van Davis looks like he's going to be by himself. Releases to Tamiron. There, they're back on the board. There we go. Jeez. Was it like a 15-point run against them? It was a 14-point run. 14 point. Oh, that just... Oh, it stings. Yep. Shots on the way. I was going to say, if, that's, if, if that goes in, just keep heading in the ball because <laughs> everything will go in. Right. No Jones down. Looking for the shot. And he's going to be fouled. Fouled going to be on Kaplan Singleton. Yeah, Mo Jones is kind of an artist when it comes to like getting guys to foul him on the shot. And it's really quite extraordinary to watch. Yeah. So he got six inches on the guy. Don't move towards him. Just stay in front of him. And he gets them up in the air and jumps into him for two, for two, two shots every time. That's going to bring Vaughn back in the game. Second shot is good. That's good. 
Scoring when the clock stops. That's a positive. There you go, James Johnson. Stay in front of him. Well, I was just going to ask that question. Where is James Johnson at? How is that not a foul? Yeah, he got it. Yeah, that's over the back. Yeah. And that's going to be on Vaughn, who just came in. Davis brings the ball down. Dribble handoff to Jones. Jones gets it over to Jackson. Gets it into Latin Davis. And nice move by Latin Davis. And Latin Davis, when he gets the ball under the rim, he's like 99%. Except for that one missed shot earlier. Lance, he got a little bit of offense. Makes Glass City want to call timeout. 11 points up. Let him call it. <laughs> so with a break in the action, we will be right back from the pyramid here. Don Johnson Fieldhouse, Lancey, Michigan. 33-22, Toledo over the home team, Lansing Farrow. Inspired by the underdog. Anyone who starts out at the bottom and makes their way to the top. Nothing to lose. Everything to gain. Inspire. Welcome back to the Pyramid. Don Johnson Fieldhouse, Lansing, Michigan. I'm Frank Stead, joined by Span. As the crowd keeps coming in, Span, this is a good thing here. 9.05 left in the second period. It's the playoffs, man. Uh, this is a home game. The next two games will be Friday and Saturday in Toledo, and Lansing has to pull at least two games for the series of this series in order to continue in the playoffs against Jamestown, who got a bye into the next round. So, this could be the last time you get to see him this season. Ooh. Nice block by James Johnson. And they're saying the ball bounced off of number five, Clemmy Owens, in the block process. So, win-win situation. Lansing keeping that momentum going. Latin brings the ball down, gives it to Sam. Sam cuts through. No doubt they're looking down low for Sam. We got the mismatch. Sam gets the mismatch down low. Up under, no good. Rebound down to Jamira. Jamira's turning around nice. Jamira's got to get going. We got to have a shot at this with Christopher Darrington already over 10 points. We got to have something to equal out his his uh, offensive efforts and we're going to stay competitive in this game. Yes, Lansing's brought it back down to within single digits. Rebound to Jackson. All these possessions have to count. Ball to James Johnson. James Johnson, three on the way, no good. Rebound comes down to Over Vaughn. So Vaughn far. gets the ball up court to Owens. Owens attacks the basket. James Johnson meets him there, but rebound by Vaughn and put right back in the basket. Oh, man, I got to give it to Vaughn, man. That ball came into his hands. He had it back up in the air within half a second. If you're going to be down there getting the rebounds, the offensive rebounds, that's how you do it. Oh, Jay, oh, 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 oh. With the, oh, Jamiron fell hard, too. Ball brought back down. He just walked again. Ugh. Shots on the way, no good. Rebound by Jamiron. Jamiron hit the ground, man. Maybe. Hold my breath a little bit. I hope they had uh, somebody mopping up the sweat over there. Ball taken by Latin. No foul. They, Latin gets his own rebound and then finishes. And he's asking, what do I got to do to get a foul? <laughs> Apparently it's getting mugged. But he still managed to score. Lansing got the lead down under double figures, finally. Yes. Dribble handoff goes to Owens on the right wing. Owens gets the ball back up top to Hawkins. Hawkins dribbles back to the right side, kicks it up top to Brown. Brown gets it back over. Down in the short corner. Turn around, shot by Owens is no good. Rebound to Sam. See if Lansing can't do a little damage here with this basketball. 6.59 left, second period. Jamiron weaves his way in, and left, oh. right, finger roll. Nice play. If they are not going to try and stop him going down the paint, let him go down the paint. Down to a seven-point lead. It's Latin Davis. 
Oh, good defense. Ball's dead. Ball's oh. kicked out to Brown. Brown is going to be fouled by oh, Sam. Oh, no. This brother here has blown more whistles in the first half <laughs> collectively by himself. I should say collectively by himself than the whole collective group did this past weekend. Yeah. And I'm not pointing fingers, but I'm just saying let them play a little basketball. I'm pointing fingers. <laughs> I mean, of course, the hometown team. Right. We're always going to be like any ref decisions against us. Ball's thrown in. I mean, we also happen to be right. (laughs) Darrington with a shot. No good. He's not going to get that. That's a flop. But the rebound comes right back down in the hands. The Singleton can't get it to fall. Gets another Uh, rebound. uh, To Vaughn. And Lancey finally pulls it down. Gets the ball up court to the cherry pick. And uh, Latin Davis. uh, uh, Making lemons out of lemonade, the Lansing Pharaohs got the lead down to five. Pratt off the screen, kicks it back out. Pump fake by Singleton, kicks yeah. it down low. Oh, why did he do that? He had a layup. Yeah, I, I yeah. I'll take Ball that James shot. Johnson, James Johnson with the fake. Three point shot, it. no oh. good. Missed it. Glass City down with the rebound. Oh, that ball looked dead in there. I was looking. James Johnson 0 for 3. I think that's the largest scoring drought he's had from the three in like four games. Left hand take oh. by Darrington is good. Nice take. It's his first bucket of the second period. Oh, Lanton Davis crossed him over. Ball to Jamiron. Jamiron with the long three is good. And he comes down. No call. Lansing lead down to four. They're going to get that one on Jones. Brown comes back in the game. Sykes comes back in. 37-33, 5-18 37-33, left. Second period. I don't know what we're talking oh. about here. You oh. hear it? Yeah, here we come. This or that. This or that. This or that. This. Okay. It's all right. Oh, good pump fake and oh. move. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. Christopher Darrington. Jones with the ball, gets it down low to Sykes. Sykes Ooh. with the reverse, nice. Way to stay in bounds on the jump stop, Sykes. I was positive he was on the, uh, the out of bounds line, but now he gathered it in. Two points on the pass from Mo, Be- Mo Jones. Pratt takes oh. it all the way down, and they're gonna call another foul. Now the crowd's getting fired up. <laughs> I mean, Latin Davis got mugged under the rim, and they calling ticky tackies on the other end. I hope, I hope the refs stay in their positions in the second half so that we could benefit from some of the offensive yes. uh, opportunity this uh, will provide. I was gonna say they didn't shot, they didn't start the shot clock, bring it down to 19. Uh oh, somebody at the score table gonna get a talking to you. James Johnson must not have. They're saying he didn't get to the table in time and he just came in for Mo. Mo stays in the game. Ball thrown into Brown. Brown hands it back to Darrington. Darrington splits the two. Nice move, can't get it to finish. And what are they calling? I told you it's this dude right here. This dude. This dude is like Teddy Valentine of the Big Ten. Stop affecting the game. Who was the guy? There was a guy in the NBA. It was like Dick Bavetta or something like that. Um, And he would, at some point in the first quarter, if the team that was favored to win was too far ahead, he would put two fouls on the lead score. Guy comes out, game becomes more even. And it was like, oh my God. Like when I realized this, like 
it blew my mind. Like, it was guaranteed that Dick Bavetta was going to call two. Like, if one team is up three to one and the team that's down uh, is, like, down 15 points or something, the team that's in the lead, two fouls immediately to try and slow down that offense and make the series more competitive. I saw it every year, and it drove me crazy. My boys was like, Spain, you're out of your mind. It's like, I guess this is my version of conspiracy theory. I'm telling you, man, that was... Nice pump fake by Sykes. Gets the shot off, and... <laughs> this guy... <laughs> He must have a. He's like. He must be a cop. He must have a quota. <laughs> I'm not saying anything bad about cops. I'm just saying. At the end of the month, seem to be a lot of guys pulled over on the road. Just saying. Yeah, I cannot disagree. I cannot disagree. Oh, oh. no good. Gotta have those. Lansing down four or four minutes to go in the half. As number three, Devontae Pratt brings the ball up, passes to number eight. Nice backdoor cut by Darrington. Oh, nobody touched him. <laughs> like everybody on Lansing's like, what can we do? We can't play defense because we always get called for the fouls. And then they don't touch dude. He falls. They still get called for the foul. Like the whole team is laughing now. They don't know what to do. This is the first time all year I've heard people boo somebody. <laughs> I think it's the refs. The refs are kind of... I, I, I do find it kind of unusual that they have three referees, but the older gentleman is calling fouls from mid-court. It's getting them for everybody, bro. He must have came from a long way getting his money for it. <laughs> Actually, straight up, I've never heard the crowd this enthusiastic, period, full stop. No. Like, they've been enthusiastic for Lansing, like, loss or victory. The game you weren't here for, that was swing, swing, and Lansing came back to beat the Jamestown Jackals, like, the crowd was very animated. I've never heard them this frustrated at all. So, clearly, they're channeling the energy of the team on the, on the court because they don't know what to do. I'll tell you, 43-37, Toledo over Lansing. As they try to get Jamiron loose. Jamiron on the back door cut. No good ball to Latin. Latin waiting on the screen from Sam. Sam gets the screen. Latin with nowhere to go. Ball knocked away. Sam with a pump fake. And we are going to get a foul on the floor. Three forty-six left. Thrown into Latin. And takes it right side. A little bit of movement. Shot on the way is good by Sykes. Man, those those are the baskets that uh, his playoffs, man. Just got to step up and play basketball. Yep. Ball up top. Vaughn. Vaughn gets it over to Darrington. Darrington with Davis on him. Nice Ooh. dribble move. Nice oh, defense by it. Darrington. Ball comes down to Jackson. Jackson up the right side of the court, no doubt. He'll pull that. You give him space. Ball's no good. Ball thrown up top to Brown. Brown gets up there, met there by Sam. Sam moves the shot. That's why Sam's up for defense player of the year. Amen. Lanton takes the ball hard to the rim. Ooh. Nice finish. And that's, hey, I'm happy. I'm glad with the no call there. Let him play. Yes. Yes. The guy made a great move. The guy played good defense. Don't bail him out. Trap in the corner. Ball smacked away. Suttles gets to it. But they're going to say the ball was actually hit out by all the balls. Yep. So we're going to get a timeout break in the action. 43-42. One point lead to lead to Glass City. We will be right back at this word from our sponsor. Fieldhouse, which is the home of Lansing Eastern High School. But uh, come game day for the Pharaohs, it's going to be called the Pyramid. 
Lansing loves basketball and has some great players that are from this city. And what I'm hearing, everybody's excited to get a chance to come out and check us out. Well, I think having the Lansing Ferrells in Lansing, Michigan will bring the community together with sponsorships from companies like Delta Dental. It helps build and strengthen our community. Uh, we're just looking forward to uh, starting the season here in March, and we hope everybody comes out and supports in there. Welcome back, Don Johnson Fieldhouse. The Pyramid, 43-42, Lansing has come back. They doubled Lansing up at one point, and it was 32-16. Yeah. And since then, Lansing's gone on a lot of a run. Well, I gotta Despite think, a lot of fouls. Yes. I'll just being honest. Yes, yes. Thank you to Clemmy Owens taking a lot of shots that did not go in. Yeah. And Christopher Darrington finally, some of his missed shots kind of strung in a row. So Lansing got space to work some offense, and their shots started falling, along with uh, a lot of good, solid defense on the other end. Man, Modro, man, changing the direction of shots, like you said. And that's everything towards keeping this game competitive. Do not let this team gain momentum by scoring a whole bunch of shots because it only amps them up on defense. Then it's impossible to get anybody open. Sam with the ball gets it down to Lanton Davis down on the short corner. Can't get the rebound to go. A shot to go. I mean, rebound down to Glass City. Ball brought down by Darrington. Left hand dribble. Nice oh. move. That's a great move. Oh, 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 oh. He stopped on a dime. <laughs> Poor Sykes was on the other side of the court like, oh, what just happened? Let me give him his props on that. Big Sam to the open three. Takes it hard to the rim. Left-hand shot. Big nice. shot by Sam. Nice. Lancing down one with a minute 50 left as number three, Devontae Paul Pratt brings the ball up court. Defense Johnson hands it to the corner over to Clemmy Owens, who is dribbling around. He drives in, passes out back to number seven, who is dribbling in, takes a short shot over Sam. No good. He gets the rebound, passes off to Latin Davis, who's bringing it up court. Long pass to James Johnson, the corner who does a layup. It does not go. Rebound by number five, Clemmy Owens. Passes it off to Darrington, who slowly brings it up court. 116 left in the half. Lansing down one. Er Darrington driving. Sykes in the way, but does not stop him. Two points. Lansing down 347-44. As Jamiron Jackson brings it back up the court. Passes across court to Latin Davis. Dribbles around. Drives baseline. Takes the short shot. Blocked, but gets the foul call. He's going to step to the line for two with a chance to bring it within one with under one minute left in the half. Yeah, and that one's on Darrington, so that's a that's a good thing for Lansing. Yes. The more fouls on him, the better. How many fouls does he have on him? Oh, uh, I've got two. Okay. Well, we need more fouls on him. First but, I mean, shot. Latin Davis has been doing his great job, like, driving hard on Darrington. 45-47. Second one's on the way. And good. Triple handoff. Great job by Jamire in getting away of yeah, that. Yeah, they closed it up right away. Shot from the corner. No good. Rebound to sight. Subtle. Well, that's Sykes. My fault. Yeah, buddy cop. <laughs> buddy cop show. <laughs> Davis with a shot. Ooh! Bang. Puts Lansing ahead for the first time. Ooh. That is beautiful. He's got 17 seconds left. Ball in the hands of Pratt. Pratt left side looking for a pick from Hawkins. Gets it to Darrington. Darrington met there by Jamire Jackson. He's going to take the shot, so just stay in his way. Just stay in his way. He's taking it. Oh, Great no. movement. Kick outside, shot on the way. No good. What a play by Darrington. I'm tell you what. Yes. That joker can hoop. Yes. Darrington is a scary, scary man. Lansing did a great job of playing some defense on him in the second half. Kind of slowed him down a little bit. But they're really going to have to keep the screws to him or put the screws on him in the second half to make sure he doesn't get off to any really significant runs. We're going to have a shot at winning this game. 
So at the half, it is 48-47. Lansing finally gets their first lead of the game. We will be right back to Don Johnson Fieldhouse after a few minute intermission. And we will give you a report on how many points Mr. Tarrington has and how many fouls the Lansing Barrows have. I wish they had a tally of how many fouls each referee called. So that's a new stat. We're going to start keeping that. We'll be right back. Sponsorships from companies like Delta Dental. It helps build and strengthen our community. Uh, we're just looking forward to uh, starting Toledo Glass City for City. In the first half, here again, Lansing needs to. I. Big, but I want to see what DeAndre Ball is the sixth guy of the year here, sixth man of the year. And for Toledo Glass City. You're going to have Pratt, Darrington, and as Pratt goes hard right away, Brown, Owens, and nice shot, and Vaughn starting for Toledo Glass City. That was a long two. They're only going to give him a long two on this, not three. Shot by Lance. He's no good. Ball to Pratt. Pratt picks up the rebound, brings it back down court. He's met there by nobody. James Johnson gave too much space, and they're going to get him with a foul. And, well, at least we left off right where we, we're picking up right where we left off. <laughs> Ridiculous. Shots on the way. Good. That'll put him at 50. Second one on the way, good as well. Ball bring down, brought down court by Davis. He's met there by Owens. And he got called for the ticky tacky. <laughs> hey, look, all I ask is if you're going to do it, do it on both sides. I, I get it, but. I remember when I was playing baseball, we had an umpire. We knew when he showed up, he was going to call balls halfway down the shin, and it drove us crazy. And the coach goes, it shouldn't drive you crazy. He's consistent with that call. Use it to your advantage. That's good. Nice shot by Sam. My thing is, is we have to work tomorrow. <laughs> got stuff to do. This brother can have us here till midnight. <laughs> 10 52 left in the game. As many of you know, if you followed us through the years, Span works at a local radio station here. Q106. Hell yeah. That's it. Lancey's Rock Station has been for a long time. Music director and assistant program director, thank you. I like my stripes. That's it, brother. I'm with you. Land Davis gets inside, changes speed, nice oh. layup. Land Davis, when he drives to the rim, is absolutely lethal. It's lovely to see. And for some reason, they don't double team him when he does, which I'll take that, you know. Ball's kicked out. Three point shot on the way. No good. A rebound to Sam. Given to Lanton. Lanton gets it up court to Mo. Mo's quick. 
gets it to Sam. Sam looked like he had the one more to James, but ooh, pass link got close. Sam with the shot, no good. Rebound to Jamiron. Jamiron up and under, no good. Sam with the tip, no good. Rebound down to Toledo. Shot off. And Jamiron oh. can. Did Jamiron get the timeout? Did he call timeout? Nope. They're saying Glass City Bowl. Nine fifty-seven left. Fifty-two, fifty-one. Lansing. Cool. <laughs> Darrington for the three from the corner. Uh. 25 points for that guy. They cannot let him get going. Oh, James Johnson picked from behind picked and they called the foul. Called him. Uh -oh. Ball thrown into Sam, short corner. Sam, hard to the basket, going to be fouled by Brown. Another foul. I will take that. He leaves him going to run out of players. <laughs> Ball thrown into Sam to the corner. Sam hard on the baseline, reverse. <laughs> nice move. Yeah, the guy didn't want to risk fouling him to stop him because he knew he had the mismatch. And, that's, so. and, and, and it goes right back to what you were saying. Use it to your advantage. Yes. Sam's a veteran. Sam knows that. Darrington with the ball, kicks it over to Vaughn. Vaughn gets it to Owens. Owens hard inside. He's met there by Sam. Sam with the block. Mo Jones, oh. nice spin off of Mo. Rebound doesn't fall. The shot don't fall. Rebound comes to Sam. Sam gets it to Mo. Mo's met there by Vaughn. Tries to go up and under over Vaughn and lays it in. Oof. We got lucky on this end with Clem missing. Uh, Cause oof, that was a defensive lax. Shot on the way by Owens. Spoke too soon. Comes back down. 57, 56 Toledo now over Lansing. Oh, nice spin by James Johnson and Ooh. finishes. Right back at him. Blocked Ooh. by Sam, but the follow by Brown. Fast and furious now. 58, yeah, 59, 58 Toledo over Lansing. Lanton has the ball, right side of the court. Almost loses his dribble, gets it over to Sam. Sam's got it back to Lanton. Back between the legs, trying to shake Brown, no doubt. No call on a foul. Ball comes down to Pratt. Pratt brings it down court. Kicks it inside to Brown. Brown kicks it back out. Three oh point Lord. shot on the way. It's good. He cannot, oh God. Clemmy Owens, if they let him get off. Last time we played them, uh, we lost uh, th the 30-point game that Darrington had. Clemmy Owens contributed 13 points on three three-pointers, so we cannot let him get off from deep. Jabiron gets it out to Latin. And this is what happened to Lansing earlier. They just come out cold. You know? Yeah. The big thing is, is you can't come down and, and get nothing, get nothing, get nothing. And we're going to get a travel. Travel is the call. 7.26 left. Third period. I see the bench reacting unfavorably to that uh, travel call. We say welcome to the club. That's it. Mo Jones with the ball. To the left side of the court. Pushes. Jamira through. Gets the ball down to Sam. Sam taking it hard to the basket. Hook shot, no good. Rebound down there by Jones. Jones back to Sam. Sam with a foul. Well, they called that one. Okay. Oh. 
62-58. Toledo over Lansing. Sam eyes up the first one on the way and wills it in the basket. Mm. Good. Soft touch. Sam sets. Second one delivered and good. Toledo brings the ball back up court. Pratt right side of the court. Gets the screen from Singleton. He's trying to figure out which side he wants to screen. Now he gives it to Singleton. Ball to Darrington. Darrington with Mo on him. Now it's Mo's turn. Nice pass. Oof. Move on. Show that she's Ball brought back down. Jackson with Darrington on him. Darrington with the flop. <laughs> no call. Yeah, they're not calling that, bro. They'll call everything else, but they're not calling specifically that one. Pratt brings the ball down. Step away. No good. Nice defense by Mo Sykes. Mojo's with the ball. Mojo gets the call to Sykes. Sykes oh. looks to kick it outside, but throws it away. Ball brought back down and layup. Right back at him. Comes Mo. Mo with a spin. And the layup. And oh. can't get the ball to go down. <laughs> that was a lot of action. Yes, it was. Mo Jones, like, just give it to me. I got this. Get a couple of points to free throw line, hopefully. Get us back within two. So we are going to get a timeout. With this timeout, we're going to stay here. And we want to give thanks to Moneyball Sports. We're at 603 North Waverly Road, 517-393-0763. BRD Printing, 912 West St. Joe, 517-372-0268. Orthopedic Rehab Specialist, 2040 North Relays Road, Suite 5, Hope, Michigan, 517-268-9040. F45 Training, 2650 East Grand River, East Lansing, Michigan. 517-366-1246. Sachs 92.1 FM. Yes, sir. 2495 Cedar Street. Speed 18C, Holt, Michigan. 517-699-0111. The Nut House, 420 East Michigan Avenue. Across the street from Jackson Field, home of the Lansing Lug Nuts. Chick-fil-A, Walk to the Wilson Protective Services. 70 official uniform provider for the Lansing oh. Yes, sir. As we get Jones at the line. First one's on the way and good. Yeah, Lansing got to start hitting these threes, man. Mm. If they do, it's game over. Jones eyes up the second one. It's on the way. Ooh. And can't get it to fall. Ball brought back down court. By Pratt. Pratt off the screen, left hand dribble, kicks it back to Singleton. Singleton left all alone for a three point shot. No good rebound by Sam. Ball to Latin Davis. Davis, oh. long corner, down court pass, stolen. Can't. That's the thing. Long shot on the way, no good. Bailed out right there. Yes. Latin. Calling him off, saying, put Sam down there. Pushing him through. Sam with a mismatch. Ball over to Jones. Jones to Sykes. Sykes with a three. Ooh, good. He's coming up big today. He is indeed. As of now, Sykes is two for three from three. So if you're going to ride the hot hand, he is the one. Ties it back up. We'll take it. Nice take by Pratt. I thought he had a layup. Good to Jones. Jones rushed down court. Jamira Jackson Ooh, with the lay in. Good. Gorgeous. Ball's brought back down court by Darrington, and he gets the left-handed shot to fall. And they didn't call the foul. Man, I tell you what. I thought that was a foul. Oh! Oh, Latin off Davis! Oh! Sam. Sam throws it down. Nice play. Latin Davis shook Darrington out of his shoes with the pass to Sam for the dunk. It was pretty. 70-68, Lansing over Toledo. 428 left. Pratt with a good pass in, 
And they're going to get a foul on Sykes. They must have got him with a body. Yeah, Caleb needs to watch him very carefully when Darrington is off the court like he is. Oh, no, he's out there. Okay. So we're still good. Darrington is going to be the major scoring threat. Jamiron with a long three. No good. Rebound comes down to the just subbed in little Mont They get ready to jump back into the ball, back in the hand of Kraft. Excuse me. Kraft with a left handed dribble met there by Little. And we're going to time out on the shot clock. Ball thrown into Pratt. Pratt met there by Montrell. All oh, balls tipped out with Jet right now. Cameraman Day from game day. Bottom. Seven. Ball. Ball's up and no good. A rebound comes down to Lansing. Sykes with the ball. Down to Muldrow. Double team down to Big Sam as he gets into the short corner. Sam wheeling the deal and turn around. Jump shot. No good. Rebound hustle Montrell. rebound by Montrell. Little, yes. That's the second hustle play he's had in this period. Yes, he has. Oh, the pick and roll. Latin met there. 12 seconds on the shot clock. Out to Sykes. He's been hot from out there. No good. Ball comes down to Pratt. Pratt one on one with Little. Dribbles it back out. Nice defense by Little. Just giving him space to work, but not letting him look at the rim. Darrington with the ball. Met there by Sykes. Now it's Sykes out of him. Oh, spins off him. And what would have been a foul in the first half? It's not a foul this half. It's a lost ball this half. And I don't know what's going on, but we got a ball thrown in. And we got a horn. And they're going to count the basket. I think the refs are trying to figure out what's going on. No, they're they're counting the basket. Okay. We're wow. just, the game's just going. All right, then. Nice job for Lansing. Step back shot, no good. And we're going to get a foul. And they're going to call that on Vaughn. As well they should. Sykes was in position for that ball. It hit him on the shoulder. So, here, to, you know, you, to the, you need to win. Oh, kudos to him. <laughs> and his money's work. 72-20, 72-70, Lansing over Toledo. Sam with the ball. Looks for the cut of Myron, no good. Little, looking for the cut as well. Gets the ball back to Jones. Jones working one-on-one. -on -one. Gets Hawkins. Gets Hawkins in the air. Gets shot up, no good. Hawkins with the rebound. As the buzzer sounded. So shot clocks are working. But they're not moving. 23-20, oh, now they're moving. Okay. Good. Oh, I was about to panic again. <laughs> Darrington with the ball, left wing. Darrington's as good as I've seen all year. Montrell Little with the excellent defense on Darrington. That was just so smooth. Yes, he Pump is. fake, one step, and shot. That was a nice job. Ball comes down to Sam. Sam with three on the way. No good. A rebound down to Pratt. Pratt comes down the left side of the court. Met there by Sykes. They're looking for the mismatch there. They, they got Mo Jones on Darrington. Blocked by Sam. Ball comes down to Jay Jamiron. Jackson to the rim. Keeps the ball. Kicks it over in the corner to Sykes. Sykes pull up jump shot. No good. Rebound by Little. Another hustle play. Sykes again. Runner's good. Uh -huh. <laughs> nice job, Montreal Little. Playing extra big minutes down low for Lansing. Ball to Pratt. No doubt they want to try and take advantage of this mismatch. They're going to get Sam with a foul. That was some tight defense. It's always frustrating when that happens, but I mean, they did the best they could. One point game now. Jamiron trying to make it wider. Oh. Bang! Oof! If you're a Farrell fan, that, you'd like to see that. Yes. You, tell you if you're a glass city guy you don't want to see this guy heat up no you don't 35 seconds left ball in the hand of Darrington Darrington took it around left triple team ball up top shot on the way three-pointers good 
Back to a one point game. Brawl brought down by Jamiron. 21 seconds left. Jamiron met there by Darrington. 16 seconds. I think this is one on one. Miss Sam on the swing. Sykes with the ball. Goes baseline shot. Nice. Short. Ball to Darrington. And it's in with 0.2 seconds left. Ball thrown in. So that's the way we are going to. I'm trying to catch this dude. That is just. Yes. Like now they're they're like seasoned vets in the league in, in the the rock league, you know, the alternative rock league. 